crime's on its ass. You see, things have changed. No one's bothered. Years ago, an alarm would go off in your front street. You'd be out, you know, is everything all right? Giving it good neighbours. You're all right, your alarm were going off. And I'm a bit of a nosy bitch. You're all right, are you sure? <laughs> I'll let you shoot. You're all right. Are you sure? That were years ago. No, no one's bothered. Hello. Have you heard that over there? Two days that's been going off over there. <laughs> Two bloody days, eh? Have you heard it's a good job not on nights. Have you heard that? They could be. They could be dead. Look at this. Twenty-six bottles of milk. The greedy bastards. Look at that, eh? What have they got? A lion? Look at all these here. Hot free papers hanging out at door. <laughs> bad crime watch is bad. I said to my sister, "Do you watch crime watch?" She went. No, she said, I don't watch it anymore. She said, it's not as good as it used to be. <laughs> video fits on Crime Watch. If you saw someone who looked like one of them video fits, it'd stick in your mind. The freaks, they don't look human. <laughs> they're just made up faces that they don't... It looks like bloody Shrek. <laughs> Shrek in a woolly hat and a donkey jacket. Go up late, shop. You cheer yourself. <laughs> can have 20 Berkeley Red. Get your hands up, other stickers. This is a fuck up. <laughs> reconstructions are bad on Crime Watch because sometimes in reconstructions they don't use actors, they actually use the staff that are involved in the robbery. They get them back in and say we're doing a reconstruction as if they're not traumatised enough. <laughs> so you, you, you've got some old woman shaking like a shitting dog, <laughs> 60 quid cashing out. All right, look, look me here. <laughs> and action. Get on the floor! Ah! Ah, it's happening again, it's happening again! Ah! That's just cruel, that, putting her back through that. <laughs> you always have some manager, right? Boring manager narrating the reconstructions. He loves it. I usually arrive at work about 20 to 8, 10 to 8. Uh, <laughs> That particular morning, the morning of the robbery, they were doing uh, road servicing work, something near the roundabout, and uh, the dual carriageway was gridlocked. Uh, get on with it, son, you're up against bad girls here. Cuts it chase, will you? <laughs> I usually open up in the mornings when I arrive. <laughs> Morning, Jean. That's wrong, Jean's been locked in. Morning, Jean. <laughs> Morning, Jean. <laughs> Put that out. Morning, Jean. About time and all been here all night. <laughs> Thought you were never going to come. <laughs> I don't move, in case the land is off. <laughs> <laughs> Where's Frank? He's late this morning. Proper wooden. Frank comes on. As I was driving towards work, I noticed a small white transit van. It was parked diagonally across both lanes. There were two men. There were two men discussing something. I do mean. There were two men discussing something. I don't know what it was, but they both had sawn off shotguns. Yeah. I couldn't. Yeah. I couldn't quite see the faces clearly as they were both wearing ski masks. I thought that's odd. As it hadn't snowed in months. He saw it all in. It's bad. They never swear when they come in as well on, on them reconstructions. Come on, get on the floor, you sponge! Come on! 